Happy Monday. Happy, happy Monday. My only accomplishment is getting showered and fresh clothes, but my pizza got me. Actually, it got me a few times. <laughs> we uh, buy those frozen Jack pizzas when they're on sale for like $2 each. And then I put stuff, more stuff on them. Like, what do we have on them today? I sliced up some black olives, extra pepperoni, onion, sliced up real thin um, Roma tomatoes. That's what got me, the tomatoes. Dripified on me. Uh, onion, mushrooms. So we have one of those pizza pizzazz cookers that you put it on and it spins around and it cooks from the top and the bottom as it spins around. So dad cooked his first and I cooked mine second. Then we usually each eat about half and then we have half later for tonight for dinner. So it works out good. Two dollars. Well, probably about three after you put all the extras on there for two meals for me. Three dollars for him, so. Not bad. I did not vlog at all this weekend, as you all noticed. Saturday, nothing day. We didn't go anywhere. We didn't do anything. Nothing day. I did start watching Netflix's um, The Lemony Snicket series of unfortunate events. I am about halfway done. So I'll finish watching. I'll watch a couple more of those today. Still working through Wentworth also. I watched one of those yesterday. This is what I do to myself. I'm like, if you want to watch Lemony Snicket, you have to watch a Wentworth first. <laughs> it's funny. Um, I've been putting this on my face now. Someone said that they had gone to the doctor and it was, and um, the rosiness is caused by the cold weather. So I've been putting a little bit of cortisone cream on there. Let's rub some in right now. Just a tiny little bit on my face. It doesn't hurt at all. It's just, it feels warm and it's red. So I'm just chalking it up to winter time. Was it rosacea? And if, if after winter's over, if it still continues, um, we will talk to the doctor. I'm also worried about the whole health insurance thing. And I tell myself, don't freak out. You have health insurance today. Don't worry about it. But if, if the Obamacare is taken away, I lose my insurance. We'll see what happens. We will see. What else do I have to tell you? We did go to the house yesterday briefly. We went out for breakfast. We stopped at Martin's supermarket. A little bit of shopping and got home. We were home before noon. Um, and then I gave Dad a Flexoril. And I put some Biofreeze on his back. His back still bothering him. Uh, so he's been resting it all afternoon yesterday. Uh, he's been doing the flex rail thing. He took one this morning. He's in there fixing to take a nap. He goes, these things really do make you tired, he says. Like, I know they do. That's why whenever I take them, I take them before bed. But since you have nowhere to go, let's just keep you relaxed. So, uh, yes. Then his shoulders have been bothering him every morning. They're really painful. So I gave him my lightest, um, I have a resistant bands and uh, so I gave him a baby one to put in there. He goes, I didn't know you had these. I'm like, I've had these for a couple years now. Uh, so this morning he said he held the one end down with his foot and was stretching his arm up like this and working it out because he said once he starts working them out, they start to feel better. But when he first wakes up in the morning, very painful. So and then he gets in the shower and puts hot water on his joints, which I did this morning and then after I I did it. He went in and did the same thing. Where does old decrepit people in this house people? Tomorrow, he's taking a class with me at the Y called, I can't remember what it's called. I can't remember. But I said, you're going to take the class, right? He goes, yes, I will try it. 
I said, if there's everything you can't do, I said, just sit down in the chair because I guess you bring a chair out with you. And um, they do some exercises from the chair and then they use the chair also for balance and um, they use weights on their ankles and, and wrists. This is just from when I watched them through the window last week. So we'll see how it goes. This will be my first land class since I had um, chair yoga that first day I ever went there. So we'll see how it goes. Um, what else is happening? Not a lot. It's pretty quiet on the Humphrey front. Did you guys do anything exciting this weekend? Our big excitement was just going out for breakfast and going shopping. When we were shopping, I did buy myself some sushi, which I had for dinner last night. So that was nice. I came, I brought it in here. I, there's some celery in the fridge I grabbed. Um, I cut me a Rice Krispie Treat, grabbed a bottle of water, came in here and ate picnic style on my bed while I watched one of the lemony snickets. So, uh, that was cool. I'm just, I have nothing to date people. Kitty's over there sleeping. She's not even interested in what I'm saying today, so you know it's boring. When the kitty's not over here, like, what are you talking about? What's going on? Oh, I'll tell you a story about Dad this morning. Back to the pizza. <laughs> he slices open the pizza thing with his little blue-handled knife. And... He sets the pizza on the metal pan that goes in the pizza pizzazz and he gives it to me and I put his, all his extra stuff on there and he puts it in the cook. Can't find that knife anywhere. Look to the trash. Maybe he threw it away. Maybe it's in this garbage up here where the food goes. Nowhere. Until the pizza's done and he moves the pizza over. What's underneath the pizza? The knife. Um, it didn't hurt his pizza but it did, it was um, slightly stuck to the pan. He had to chip it off, scrape, or scrape the pan off. He goes, I am losing my ever loving mind. I'm losing it, he said. I'm like, well, I've told you. Talk to your doctor about stuff like that, that you get confused. Because he does, he gets confused a lot. So. He was just disgusted with himself after that happened. Anything else happening? Nope. The only thing happening this week, my accountant's coming on Wednesday. We'll get uh, end of year tax stuff done for payroll. Pay unemployment taxes. Do the W-2s for the employees to put in their paychecks. Uh, yesterday I entered everything in that we need. We're going to reconcile December to the end of the year to make sure we're all matched up with bank statements to QuickBooks. I got a few questions written down here for her. And um, so that's the only thing coming up this, this week besides the why. Alright. Oh man. I'm done. I think I'm gonna go watch something on Netflix or I've been playing a lot of gin rummy lately. I keep getting stuck at almost getting to level 9 from level 10 and then someone beats me and puts me down. I'm like, who? come on I want to get to level 9. Dang it. All right. Kitty, do you even want to come say anything? No, she's passed out. She don't care right now. Tell me a story. You guys tell me a good story. Bye.